Myersco surged up the EYBL standings with a 4-1 mark in Latvia, which included a win over European junior powerhouse BC Zalgiris. After an opening defeat at Stage 2, Myersco showed grit and bounced back, reeling off four straight wins to stay squarely in the Final Four conversation ahead of a crucial February trip to Poland. After a comfortable victory over Cracovia to start Stage 3 of the EYBL campaign, Myersko can head back to the hotel to relax, recover, and prepare for Game 2 later in the afternoon. Won the first game by about 30, 34, 36. My man there, player of the game, just 22 points. Anyways, how do you feel about your performance? Mm. So, in this time, when you're in the group, I ran around with great bricks and stuff. I don't pass it, just like the gym. So, what is your favorite color? Cheers, man. Majesko's final four hopes faced an early scare against Polish team Vladislav Ovo. Starting point guard Rayon Brown went down with an injury that curbed momentum and kept them sidelined for an extended stretch during the game. Sko also had to withstand a furious comeback to ensure they locked up win number two. Trying to you know, take care of all the small jobs, look at 
things that I can do to kind of relieve some of the pressure from Neil. But for me, it's just finding whatever's needed. You know, the jobs needs to be doing, just take care of it and try and look at things and say, can I solve a problem before it gets to Neil? You know, so that could, could be, you know, if Neil's playing bad cop, I'm playing good cop. It could be speaking to a guy after he's coming out of the game just to give him some feedback on what's just happened. Whatever it is, just making sure that we're always staying on track with the game plan and kind of not just allowing guys to fizzle out. But I've learned, you know, as we've gone through this, what the expectation is from Neil. I think as a coaching staff, we've grown through the process in terms of how we prepare, how we look at teams, how we make adjustments on the fly. For me, it's been a great learning curve because how we have to play out here is completely different how we play in England. So it's really forcing, you know, myself, you know, to stay on the ball and kind of think of suggestions. And I think the biggest thing that I took away from Neil was just, you know, we don't need to describe what's already happened. It's about providing a solution moving forward. That's what we Like, it's bigger than any game for us. Like, we need to put in 100%. In order to make Final Fours, we have to focus today and play maturely, to be honest. Like, I, I came into this league not, not knowing what to expect, and for us being here right now to be able to fight for such a big place is just crazy in my eyes. So we just need to, to do what we came for. Belarus, Latvia, or wherever, at the moment we've, we've etched a name for ourselves. How many times did I say in timeouts, team talks, you know, post games, whatever, that we're about trying to get credibility? Well, we've got it now. Okay, we have it. We've earned it. You no, know, we've earned it the hard way. Let's get a hand in. Let's go. Yay! Let's go on, lads. Found on me, One, two, three, found Despite ending stage three with a loss to Smoky Minsk, there's still more to play for, and the journey is just beginning for Myersko. It's quite difficult, actually, for someone at the age of 16, 17, 18 to quantify what we're, what we're doing, what we're doing, and what we've achieved. You know, it's been an eye-opening experience for, for myself and for the players. You know, I've always quite, kind of taken pride in providing opportunity for young British players, coaches, you know, and our program to have an experience at the next level. And you know, this has given us that chance, and um, you know, I wouldn't change it for, for anything. <laughs> 